In this video, Evo Medical Solutions is going to give you a step-by-step -step process walking you through the assembly and functions of the Medi Aspirator 606 suction unit. The Medi Aspirator is the ideal suction unit for inpatient and outpatient care requirements. It features high-performance vacuum specification and a durable piston-type compressor with a very easy-to-read gauge. In the box, you will find the AC-powered aspirator unit, an 800cc suction canister, 6 feet of connection tubing, a hydrophobic air filter with tubing, and an instruction manual. Before each use, inspect the suction pump and the accessories for damage or wear, replace as needed. First, seal the canister properly with the lid and then put the sealed canister into the bracket. Make sure the power is in the O or off position. Turn the pressure adjusting knob to the minimum suction power. This reassures it's safe to plug the power cord in. Connect the two tubes of the tubing filter together and then connect the straight end to the air inlet of the pump and then the right angle to the air outlet of the canister lid. Next. Connect the suction tube to the fluid inlet of the canister lid. Press the power switch to the I or on position and adjust the suction pressure to the ordered value to start with the suction procedure. Refer to the instruction manual for expert suggestions for the endo and nasal tracheal suction pressures. Suction time should always be less than 15 seconds, and repeating suction should never occur before 2 minutes after each use. When finished with suction, turn the power of the Medi aspirator to the off position and unplug from the wall. Finally, Dispose of the waste and suction accessories properly and clean off the suction pump and all exposed body parts thoroughly. Warning: To avoid the risk of electrocution, never leave the product unattended when plugged in.